Hello again. So today, what I wanted to talk about is how underage drinking ruined my life. How when I was a youngster, or, you know, <laughs> I said youngster, I didn't think I would ever say that, but I did. I ran around these woods willy-nilly, doing whatever I wanted, getting away with underage drinking, stealing booze from my uh, friends' parents, and doing various other substances, and, you know, how if someone had just been, you know, a little more attentive, I wouldn't have had my life go the way it went. And I was incarcerated at the age of 17, sent to an actual adult jail, because here in the state of New Hampshire, you're considered an adult at 17, and they will send you to jail. So I'm walking today along the railroad tracks, and I see a group of what looks to be like four children between the ages of 12 and 13, 14, maybe. And I look, and they all scatter and run the other way, and there's what appears to be a 12-pack of Bud Light, and the first thing that I do when I encounter something like this is I call the most responsible parent I know in the area, and she puts the word out to other parents in the area to let them know where they are, what they're doing, and I just really wish that I had had something like that when I was younger, because going to jail at that young age really did ruin my life. It put everything in turmoil, it opened me up to a whole new world of how abusive and terrible certain adults can be. And what I want to do is to accomplish like a... Uh, like I don't know how to say it. How do you set up like a protective thing for children in the area so that they don't become dregs of America, drunk, stupid, uneducated, and working a dead-end job, miserable, and grow up hating themselves and wanting to die. So, maybe you guys can help me, my viewers, with suggestions on how to set up a community of adults protecting children. Leave your comments, like and share. Thank you so much. I hope you have a wonderful day.